Hi, today I'm going to show you some of the cool things you can do with OmniDazzle. OmniDazzle is an application made by the Omni Group. Um, what it does is basically you can jazz up your mouse. You can add cursor trails. Uh, right now I have Pixie Dust enabled and in configuration you can see that I have it set. So if I shake it six times, my mouse pixie dust erupts on my screen and if I keep doing it it just I get pixie dust all over my screen now pixie dust obviously isn't the only one right you, up here you can see we've got footprints so if I do this footprints follow my cursor around the screen Because I have a dark background, it's a little hard to see, but if I walk on this, you can see very clearly there are footprints following my cursor. You can also set whether you want it to be a human foot, a mouse foot, peg leg, dog foot, duck foot, high heels, etc. And now I've got them still, and I'll just tell them to stop following me. Now we have focal point, which might help for other things such as giving presentations. What you do is, I'm just going to rename these to Alt 1 and Alt 2 because I have Control 1 and 2 doing something else. So if I do go this, it will tell me what's in focus. So if I select over here, say, and then if you do highlight under pointer, I'll just click here to say see if I change this it also tells me and it will just tell me what's under the pointer at the moment highlight under pointer see I can just close that uh oh it's telling me I'm doing something wrong okay there we go so it will select a window, select app. This flashlight is also good for presentations. Just puts a beam of light around your pointer and you can tell it to dim the back of the screen. And in these settings you can tell it how big you want the circle and how dark you want the rest of the screen. Cut out, you can draw on the screen. I'm just going to do this. And Alt 3. Alright, so if I do one, I can just cut out this with a circle, or I could cut this out with a square. Maybe I want to do an oval over here. Now it will show my thing my screen with these shapes on it. We also have comic where we just give her a little nifty key combination right here. So you detonate. And ooh, kapow, kapow, pow, squelch, pow, kapow, biff, zot, rend, zot, zot, pow, rend, pot, pow, pow, fold, squelch, kapow, kapow. This could also be fun for presentations. And bullseye, which might help with the visually impaired. I just hit my nifty key combination once again. And hey look, a bullseye. Now I can make my bullseye bigger and add more rings, etc. Now if we go over to the other side, back to pixie dust, and now to scribble. If I do this, one, I can now draw on the screen. I'm going to use my Wacom tablet. Here with white ink, maybe let's add some red ink. Let's cross this out in red ink. Or we can say, maybe in blue ink, we want to say, Hi, YouTube. And you can see I'm still going over things in the background. I might want to cross that out in green. 
and I might want to correct it with hi viewers or maybe I really really like this feature so I want to go and say that's my key combination or maybe this these are the two pens I need to edit and I can send that all to go away by once again hitting my nifty key combination and uh, now uh, something else sonar this is kinda cool um, I just hit my key combination and every time it sees my mouse I'm just gonna kinda leave it there here let me bring it closer we're into the inner circle there every time it sees my mouse it makes a tone just like real sonar you can adjust the ring radius, the ping size, and how fast it's going. Um, might be a little more interesting if you speed it up because it's just kind of boring. But it can also be helped for the visually impaired or people who have, who lose their cursor across multiple screens, for example. Um, make waves. This has some bad graphics, but it's simple enough and it works. It puts waves wherever your cursor is around it, so you can find them and zoom this is the last and I'm just gonna change this to alt 1 so now if I select alt 1 and I will just tell it to zoom this key and shake so it'll tell me that I'm currently in key preferences now I'll just hit control little backwards apostrophe there and we're back so that was a quick overview of Omni Dazzle, and it certainly does dazzle with all these little sparkles and other effects. Um, more of these effects will be coming in the near future, so stay tuned.